Stefanos Tsitsipas versus Novak Djokovic is a fourth group stage match for the ATP Finals for 2022. And both guys have had very different seasons to get to the finals. To start the season, Tsitsipas was at number four in the world, and with a strange mid-season slump, he recovered well to end the year off as number three in the world. His record for the season, 59 wins, 22 losses. One of the most active players this year, and another massive season of tournaments played. He did make five finals, but he only won the two titles from those five finals. He went back to back in Monte Carlo, and he won his first grass court event in Mallorca just before Wimbledon. His best win, he beat Daniel Medvedev in Cincinnati, who was number one at the time. A very big win for Steph, especially on a hard court, and against a guy that he hasn't beaten that many times in their careers. His worst loss, though, was at the start of the year in Marseille against the 163 in the world, Sefulin, who was a qualifier in that event. Djokovic started the year off as a world number one, and as most of you know, he was unable to defend a lot of the points due to politics getting involved and him not being allowed to play many of the tournaments throughout the season. And while he did maintain his number one ranking for most of the first six months after Wimbledon, he dropped down the ranks, finishing at number eight in the world. His record this season, considering he didn't play that much, 37 wins, seven losses, winning four out of the six finals that he played, winning in Rome and Wimbledon at the start of the season, and then in recent weeks, winning in Tel Aviv and Astana, and of course, who can forget that Paris final he played only a week ago. His best win against the world number four at the time, Medvedev in Astana, and his worst loss coming in his first event of the season, all the way back in late February against Vesely, the 123 in the world, in Dubai. So I guess you can kind of put an asterisk next to that loss, considering it was Djokovic's first time back for almost three months at that time. These guys have played 11 times before, with Djokovic leading the head-to-head 9-2, and also has won all their meetings this year, but their last meeting was in Paris a couple weeks ago, and Pass did have chances to take that semi-final on the indoor hardcourt. So maybe there is a chance Tsitsipas can turn this one around. If Tsitsipas is going to win this match, he's going to have to play like he did in Paris from the second set onwards. First set, he was blown out of the water by Djokovic and it looked like another straight sets win for Norway. But Tsitsipas has to have a better start to give himself any chance of winning this match. If Djokovic is going to win, he needs to get off to a good start and keep that good start going because he did run out of gas in the second set against Tsitsipas and then almost lost it in the third. And we all know what happened in Paris against Runa the day after that. So Djokovic is going to have to keep his focus throughout the match and keep his energy up. This is always a fun match to watch, but I think that Djokovic on the hard courts has got the edge. Even though they played a close one in Paris, I think Nole is going to get the job done. Maybe in three sets again, maybe a straight set. So over three sets just for fun. But let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this first matchup?